Days ago, sources tell WBZ's John Keller that Attorney General Maura Healey is ready to run for governor of Massachusetts. And breaking tonight, we've learned that formal announcement will come tomorrow. WBZ's Ken McLeod is live tonight on Beacon Hill with more on what this means for the Democratic field. Ken. Anna Rittis Maura Healy is only 5'4", and yet she captained her college basketball team and played professionally overseas. She says it taught her to take on challenging fights. Well, tomorrow, she'll announce her run for governor. These are all great things. For she's society. been telling confidants for several yeah, days that she's made her decision, uh, and tonight, BZ political guru John sense. Keller but, says you know. she's about to push the launch button, becoming the immediate front runner, like it or not. Nobody necessarily wants to be uh, the front runner uh, any earlier than they have to be because you're instantly uh, a target. A target for Democrats already in the race. Harvard professor Danielle Allen and state senator Sonia Chang Diaz, along with Republican Jeff Deal, a former state rep, who Keller doesn't see repeating Governor Charlie Baker's red victory in a blue state. Particularly since the lone Republican in the race so far, Jeff Deal, has tied himself to the SS Donald Trump. A political unknown when she pulled off a surprise win in 2014, Healy has grabbed national name recognition as state attorney general by suing corporate giants and tackling a number of causes important to the progressive left. If elected, she'd be only the third openly gay governor in the country. We are the first state to legalize gay marriage. and. Uh, no one even really talks about it anymore. Right. So I don't see that as an issue at all. Tonight, both Democrats issued statements welcoming Healy to the race and framing their differences, while some political observers wonder if former Boston Mayor Marty Walsh might jump in. Every indication I've had is that while Walsh has always been interested in being governor one day, he was a state rep for many years, he's not interested in running against Maura Healey. The Healey bid for governor comes on the heels of monster wins by Congresswoman Ayanna Presley and Boston Mayor Michelle Wu, and Keller is among those who see a trend. Where women, people of color, uh, are stepping up uh, to seize political power in Massachusetts. Healy already has quite a campaign war chest, more than three and a half million dollars. 500,000 of that was raised in December, right after Charlie Baker announced he would not seek a third term. Live at the State House tonight, Ken McLeod, WBZ News. Ken, thank you.